guys welcome back to the christmas extravaganza thank you all for tuning in so much as you can see in the background here we have received lots more cards so thank you to everyone who has participated in this year's christmas card exchange they're great i don't have them all up yet because i ran out of these little hangers right here but y'all i appreciate these cards so much i've read each and every i know a lot of you like have attached letters to these they're great, y'all. I'm so, like, overwhelmed with the amount of support that I've ha gained through just having this channel. Um, I don't even know what to say about it, but thank you all so much. I'm going to have my cards going out probably, like I said, sometime this week. As you can see, we've got some um, homemade cards, ornaments, some uh, artwork over here. All these cards are great, y'all. And I hope everybody is having a great holiday season thus far, whether you celebrate or not. I hope everything is going great. Now, with that being said, guys, also, um, if you all need to contact me, uh, like Twitter and Instagram and things like and DMs just aren't that great because normally if I go on those platforms, I just go on there to, to like, you know, to see what people are posting, to like pictures and things. I don't really get into my DMs that much, but I have went ahead and created a new like uh, email account for you guys. I put the email in the description, so if you need to contact me, you can do that there. But yeah, thank you guys for participating. With that being said, y'all, let's get in to today's video. So, Chantel is home, you guys, you know, from the hospital from a second time. Remember, she went she had her original, she went and had the hysterectomy done. Then she came home and she thought she had some kind of issue with her incision, which a lot of people have been saying it's just normal that happens when you have, uh, I guess, that kind of surgery. She had some leakage. She went and got that repaired. She's all patched up. She's right back to it. I think the very next day she was right back to mukbangs. Um, yesterday, I believe she recorded, or the day before yesterday, she had did um, like a foot long or something like that. And I think that was one right back from her hospital visit from her leakage. And then yesterday she put up Big Mac special, which is that video is what we're going to react to today. So with that being said, y'all, I'm going to shut up. If you need to get a hold of me, the email's in the description. My second channel's in the description. My PO box, if you all want to join the Christmas card exchange, is in the description. All that information is just down below. Yeah, so let's get into this video. Back to the Christmas intros I see. Rudolph the red-nosed reindeer had a very shiny nose. Hey guys, hey, hey guys, hey, how are you? How are you? I'm hyper and you're gonna get it. Horrible. I'm absolutely devastated after that intro, Chantel. All right, so let's get to, let's get to, no time to talk before I take a bite. Fries, McDonald's. So was it necessary for the two Big Mac Chantel? And I have never, ever, ever, ever seen anybody get aside a Big Mac sauce. So think you've done this before, but other than you, I don't think I've seen it done before. Did you bite? She looks like she's feeling great, doesn't she? It must be, they must got her on some good stuff, y'all. Mac sauce? Mm. 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 Oh yeah, mmm. Didn't Chantel stay in her last uh, McDonald's mukbang? Remember when she got that huge, like, family for four dinner that she did not like uh, the the hamburger patty on her Big Mac and she took it off? Let's see if she keeps it on there. Better than dipping it in anything. <laughs> so. So. We may have noticed a new addition to the family. A fake mole. Oh, wow. And you know, there's a pimple there. <laughs> so I was like, how can I cover it up? Well, with a fake mole. And I used to do fake moles in like elementary school. I went through a Madonna phase when I was in elementary school. And this was before I had tits. So I, um, I used to draw a fake mole. And you know those like water coolers, water dispensers that have those cone cups? Well, I remember watching like my- I'm so glad I was normal in elementary and just like coloring with my crayons or playing with my Barbie dolls and was not even concerned with drawing fake moles on my face. 
on his truth or dare tour over and over and over when I was a kid. So I used to like run into the office because like we weren't allowed there to run and take water from their dispenser. It was like the teachers and everything, like the staff room. So I used to like sneak in, <laughs> grab some cone cups and like stuff, like put them in my shirt, like make it work. I used to like tape them down and oh, anyway. In elementary school? I mean, who was even thinking about that at that age? Um, yeah, so I got in trouble one day. Like, no joke, I got in trouble. Um, the principal actually caught me and yelled at me. Do y'all like the shirt? I love this shirt. Walmart. $10, I believe. It's like a hoodie. You can't see, but it's got a hood on it, and it's got, like, a regular hoodie pocket. Ain't it so cute, y'all? They got more. I'm going to have to go get back and get me another one. I didn't know if I was going to like it, but I actually freaking love it. I wish it was, like, something other than Christmas, too, because it's really, like, nice material and everything. Like, Walmart's stepping up their game. I normally never get clothes from there, but, yeah. Like, I really like it, y'all. Super festive. Perfect for our card background, our Christmas theme that we have here. Back to the tragedy they yelled at you back then they yelled at you yeah you probably needed it <laughs> you were stealing mm. stealing mm. This stuff's not free fruitopia <sighs> the lipstick i'm wearing today is nobody cares i think it's radical Rose nobody cares red Royale. nobody cares red i should take it off because this is gonna get so messy Taking my ring off. <laughs> All right. I got Before two long, Big Macs one naked. just isn't enough. Oh, the bun is soft. Oh, you gonna eat that meat? Ooh, ooh, ooh. You gonna eat that meat? Beauty, bite. Just delicious. So Extra good. Mac sauce. Should I wipe, wipe the mole off in case it comes off? I need a bib. Please I need a bib that bib. says beauty bite or something because... Please get the bib. I vote for the bib. Ugh, my hair gets I in the way. I vote for the bib. All right, the so bib. I have a story time for you. I broke the law, mm. but I didn't know about it. Breaking the law. This time. Breaking the law. I didn't know it was breaking the law. Breaking the law. Breaking the law. Breaking the law. Oh, by the way. Once I'm healed and can go back to the gym. I was watching a girl. When, seriously, when did you ever, like, go to the gym? That little day or two does not count as you going to the gym. Is she serious about actually saying that she's going back to something that she's never done before? Dead. Oh, oh shit, what's her name? Katia Eats Kilos, I think? Man, this girl is my inspiration. She's a foodie. She loves food, but she doesn't want to gain weight, right? So she lifts. She doesn't even oh, really do cardio. She's God. just really muscular because the more muscle you have, wow. the more your metabolism, you know, you can burn more calories Stop just at rest. It. You are not. When I go to the gym, I love the weights part. I hate cardio. She has no idea about actually lifting weights. She has no idea what she does or does not like at the gym. P please. Mmm, this is so good. I'm going to sit here and talk about getting healthy at the gym. I ate my two Big Macs. Well, you hate it. That's her plan. That's her new plan, y'all. That's her new scheme is that she's, what, going to go be this big buff person and then be able to eat whatever she wants okay. I'm here for it so I'm gonna do what she does like honestly really I'm gonna lift really <clears throat> and really? eat <laughs> wow seriously I, I mean, I don't think she realizes, like, all you're seeing is this girl eating on camera. You do not realize, like, the discipline. These people fast. They go without eating. They do all this to be able to have this one. And they do all that working out to have a meal like that, Chantel. I'm not going to do, like, food challenges and eat 10,000 calories, but. You do that without doing a challenge. 
I'm gonna hate it. <laughs> I can't wait for this part. I really cannot. No, yeah. I don't know about you, but I'm excited about this. I'm all for it. Go for it, Chantel. Yeah, that's the key. She only does it like, you know, I might, I'm not going to do it like every day with crying food. Oh, really? So, all right. But she's done I how many in a row law. since she's been home. So this is what happened. So there's two people I need to give names to. Uh-huh. My friend watching this will know who I'm talking about. So, uh -huh. I was visiting a friend. We'll call her Katrina. 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 And I was visiting a friend. We were hanging out. Uh -huh. Um, We had this, I knew this like girl through my friend Katrina. She had a friend. Um, now you got to know that I was hanging out with her in my hometown. There's a, a bridge in my hometown. What is that? Oh, okay. <laughs> that when you go over it, you, it's the bridge to upstate New York, Messina. But when you go over the bridge in between the United States border and the Canadian border, mm -hmm. there's a native reserve. Okay. Mm -hmm. And our friend was lived on the native reserve and she had a dual citizenship because she's native American Canadian and we'll call her Jenna. I don't know. So Jenna <clears throat> lived there. She didn't have a car. Jenna, I, and Katrina used to party together because she was a lot of fun. They were a lot of fun. Mm -hmm. Um, but Jesus, when Jenna, so would she's get... already she's already got a go set, y'all. She's already got a plan. There's always some kind of like first she'll go on this what she's been doing this fat acceptance blah 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 kick that she's been doing. What happened to that? What happened to us? She was just going to accept who she is. Then she goes vegan or then she goes, I don't know, OMAD. Oh Wasn't she just like doing OMAD oh the other day? Or is that just like a one time whenever you want to do it thing? Or keto. So now she's got it in her little pea brain that she's going to go lift weights at the gym and eat like this and be, I guess, a skinny legend. I am so signed up for it. Front row, Chantel, we're here. Like a boyfriend, she'd become very annoying, I guess. Who became annoying? Who's she talking about? I missed it. Asking for stuff like We need to be able to interact ride. with these, y'all. I need to start doing them live. And you gotta remember, every time you go over the bridge, you have to pay a toll, three twenty five, or like three seventy five, there and back, like each way. Mm hmm. We have toll bridges. More expensive than that. Sounds like birds killing each other outside or something. So my friend Katrina was just over it, you know? They're always like mooching rides and... Are we talking about somebody? That's no Can surprise. Can you come pick up me and my boyfriend? We're bored. Can you bring us McDonald's? Like that kind of thing. Um, Her most recent guy she met online, he was like... He was like... Living in like upstate New York, but like illegally, I think he was like from a, some fr yeah. somewhere from like the Caribbean. Sounds familiar. No name. I think Kiki. she told me. <laughs> Speaking of Kiki, also Pixie Pix, who uh, also has a channel, sent me. She's the one that sent me this. Uh, oh, let me get Chantel off the screen. Who cares? We can take a break from this crap. She's the one that sent me this drawing right here. Beautiful, and she also, guys. Is this not the awesomest thing ever? Kiki's first Christmas. We're definitely, I will make a video reading this book. It'll be great. Super great. I don't know. I just needed to share that with you guys. Back to the shit show. Telling her a story that makes no sense already. So I was one day at Katrina's and we were drinking, having some drinks. Having some drinks at Katrina's. Gotcha. Following. And... What did I say her name was? Ooh. What does she see that she's eating off this damn cutting board? What does she use this cutting board to like 
uh, cut up her chicken or whatever it is that she makes and didn't properly disinfect it. Ugh. And then she's just, the the thought of it. Got her Jenna? food all laid out on raw <laughs> I can't chicken even remember my fake hamburger. names. Gross. I said Jenna. So Jenna messaged, uh, messaged Katrina and was like, you know, can you, uh, bite a finger. That's all I'm waiting on. Where are you up to? Oh, I'm chilling with Chantal, you know, I'm having some drinks. Oh my God, that sounds like fun. Can you come get us? No, I'm sorry. We didn't start drinking yet because I wouldn't have driven to go get Jenna yet. Mm -hmm. So we were planning on drinking that night, but we had July to start straight, Chantal, July <laughs> There's no way I'm going through the border drinking, you know, or driving drinking. So, it was just like I think I got a bottle of wine anyway, but no, you don't, you know, drink and drive, obviously. So, she's like, oh, we're going to have some drinks and hang out, whatever. She's like, oh, look, can we come, you know, and everything like that. And um, she was like, um, Katrina was like, well, what I don't really feel like going cafeteria? all the way over there, you know, blah, blah, blah. My car's not doing great. So then... These stories are god awful. She had asked Katrina to ask me, and I was like, "Whatever, you know." I was like, "Sure, the more the merrier," you know. Plus, I was like kind of curious to see what her newest boyfriend was like. So, trying to steal somebody's name. And she name, offered to pay toll this time. So I go over, and um, go pick them up on the reserve. Her boyfriend didn't say a word to me. Damn, it sounds like a lot of birds outside. Like very... Jeez. Who came off as kind of rude? Jesus. Like, you're just meeting somebody. You know, you could have say hi. Somebody picking you up. <laughs> but no. No hi, no nothing. Ooh, so right on the raw meat board. That's better. <laughs> so. Mm -hmm. Now, I just assumed that her boyfriend She's shifting eyes today, y'all. Probably checking to see if BB's coming in. Had a passport or some ID to get back in Canada. Or to go into Canada, period. Because they check you really well at the border. And you can get in shit. You can get arrested or detained, whatever. Who would be that ballsy to tr attempt going over with nothing, right? Well, <laughs> he sits in the back seat behind me okay so let's do a quick recap for anybody who's lost i think that she's hanging out with some girl i don't know who she is i don't forgot the name that she made up for and there's another girl who i think she's accusing of being a bum who has a bummy boyfriend who always wants rides and they're going from canada to new york to back to canada and they gotta pay a toll and i think she's going to tell that the guy don't have like I guess, um, what is it? A passport that you need to cross? I don't know. I don't go across the border. How do I know? Look at the steel guys. Look. I'm loving it. Shh. I said shh. Does it look like what she's going to say? Anyways, back to your story, Chantel. Like her because she goes through a lot. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. And she has like that <clears throat> special, um, pass. But they're like, they check me. So we pull up. Right before we're about to go up to the border patrol guy, this guy in the back duck, like, ducks down. Takes off running. And like right before that, um, Jenna was like, okay, babe, now. He ducks down under the seat. Now, he was really, really, really small. Luckily, he was small. And I was just like thinking, I was like, what's he doing, you know? And then it clicked into me that he wants to be smuggled across. <laughs> She's smuggling people. She's a smuggler. Mm, I was so pissed. I was freaking out. 
So it's going to be okay. They're not going to see him. We get up there. How are they going to get How back? How the lady's doing? Grabs my uh, ID. Looks at it. Qu Luckily, I swear a guardian angel quickly glanced in the back. Didn't bother to really look into it. You know, sometimes they go in, check the back seats, pop, the, they say pop the trunk. I would have been screwed. Luckiest, here you are, Chantel. So. Yeah, did you see the Big Mac sauce on her tongue? He didn't. Yuck. She, um, let us go. Uh-huh. So they got through. They smuggled. They're smugglers at this They're point. They're actually really friendly at the Canadian border, usually. <laughs> Not yeah. so much the American border on um, that way. Man, it's like military. I have a story about that. Oh, yeah. Oh, boy. Bet you do. So once we get a... This girl could go to Walmart and have a story time for y'all. Like, every little detail, every little something that happens to her life could turn into a story time. Us, I was, like, quiet. Like, I didn't even want to be in her presence. Like, that was it for me. I didn't talk she to her anymore, done. and I could see what Katrina meant by her. Like... Fed up. Had enough. She got rid of that friend. How rude and disrespectful do you do? You don't do that to a friend. Like, You're I would never do that to Rena. You know, like, I could have got a criminal record. <laughs> like... You know? We know, Shanta. Oh, man. I was mad. I'm more concerned about the fries she's eating off that dirty chopping board. And I and told Katrina story. that. I'm like, yo, what just happened? And she was like, no way. Yes way. So it made for a really awkward evening because... Are well, they still hung out? Second one. Oh, my God. It's so saucy. Number two. Beep, with two beep, beef beep. patties that she does not like. Mmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. This wish is so good, Chantel. I'm gonna go lift weights after this and be such a skinny legend. Whoa, it's really saucy. How do y'all think that Amber and a a Amber and Chantel feel about Amy and Tammy getting their own shows? And now that Amy's done got the light, the whatever you want to call it, the gastric bypass, probably she's gonna be all skinny and stuff. They're gonna be so jealous. It's gonna be good. <laughs> mm. <clears throat> I love these so, fries with a little bit anyway. of chicken blood. Love it. Mm. What are you getting out of that box? Lettuce? Yeah, made for an awkward evening because I was so pissed. Katrina was kind of like pissed at the whole thing. Mm hmm That was a great story time, I'm telling you. Not only that, the whole time, this guy is antisocial AF. Like he sat at the table. Mm-hmm. And my friend is like a clean freak, like OCD. She's going to knock that out. Okay. Off. She's got it balanced so, on a book, it looks like. Totally not like you, I'm assuming, then. This guy had, like, <clears throat> dreadlocks. And when you have dreadlocks, anyone with dreadlocks can vouch for this. <laughs> you need to maintain them. seems super judgmental. His weren't like beautiful Jamaican dreadlocks. They were like hippie who hasn't washed in six months dreadlocks. No. Okay. No. They were nasty. They were dirty. When you come on here with your hair it looks like I ain't been washed in a year. No Chantel. And he's sitting at the table. Her table. Her table guys. Taking the elastics out with his like and like combing the frizzy, like the dead hair out with his like three inch long, dirty, dirty nails. And all the hair is flying everywhere. No way. Nobody would do that. It's like. 
I almost caught a criminal record. To sit in the glory of your presence, inhaling your dead hair. No thanks. I was mad. Now, to drive her back, you don't have to cross back. Like, it would just be me crossing back into Canada. But if it, if I had to go through another border to get them home, they'd be walking. Yeah, I wouldn't be doing that. Uh -huh. <laughs> Jesus Christ. She inhaled that shit. That was a horrible story, Tom Chantel. Man, I was mad. I still am. If you can't tell. <laughs> 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 Just thinking of like... <clears throat> What could have happened? You know? Could have did time, Chantel. It's enough to freak you out. Three hots in a cot, Chantel. Mm. Beauty bite. Beauty bite, guys. Mm. I was craving Big Macs. I love oh, I Big can't Macs. wait till she starts working out with the weights. So. It's going to be great. You're a motherfucker, Chantel. What can you say? Not cool. Jesus. That's not cool. Mm. Still going, are we? So, yeah. Almost got in trouble there. Because usually, most of the time, they do check the back seats and trunk. Lucky you. Oh, so are you guys excited for the holidays? <laughs> yeah, Chantel, can't you tell? I just want to get better. Doing a lot better today. Every day. Good to hear. Um, Can't wait to see you in the gym. Just want to get like better so I can do more like outside of the house. Like, oh yeah. You know, go places with Pete's and do vlogs. Like, do fun holiday stuff. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> I'm gonna try maybe next week. Definitely gonna do stuff before Christmas, but. Oh my god, there's nothing left. Nothing. Because I can walk. And I feel so much lighter. <laughs> like You're inside. Looking. With Definitely. that thing gone. At least 30 pounds down. That mask on. No doubt. She looks great, guys. Great. I was pushing on everything. <laughs> Have we heard from Chantel since she's ate off this cutting board? Do we know if she's okay? It's like a saw. You ever seen one of those saws where they just stick them and they go, Meow, and then you like get a big tree branch. Mm -hmm. Meow, Meow. Watch. Hold on. Wait till she does it. Wait for it. Meow. Do it again, Chantel. So that bodybuilder woman? Oh yeah, let's hear more about that. She divides her calories out. <clears throat> over a weekly period. <laughs> Is that what you're going to do? Sounds like a great plan. So the days that she does eating challenges. Mm -hmm. The other days it's like veggies and water. <laughs> oh, and that's what you're going to do. But no matter what you do, to be successful you need discipline, right? And I don't have that. So this will be a good time to really keep that in the back of my mind. Like discipline, discipline. Discipline. Yeah. And knowing I'm going to be eating for a cause and not just to, like for my channel and for getting to a goal. Mm -hmm. And not, not using it to feed a food, uh, an eating disorder. Totally agree, Chantel. Yeah. Totally different context, you know? That's right. 
Great we'll idea. See. Here for it. I'm looking more into it. Can't wait. See how it's done. So excited. But first, I gotta get it's that. It's like a Christmas gift, y'all. But it keeps on giving. That will be. Get that salmonella off there, Chantel. Little chicken blood. Work in progress, you know. Probably some hamburger blood. So, anyways, guys. That's it. I'm gonna go wash this, and <clears throat> that's it for today. So, I hope you enjoyed this video. Excuse me, I need to sip on my drink. I have a second channel, in case you don't know. I've been Already promoting it left and right, but I have a second channel, Chantel Marie Vlogs, and I plan on doing some beauty stuff, some plus size stuff, like talk about my plus size life, I guess. You're gonna be a skinny and, um, you can't be doing that no more. Mostly vlogs too with pizza and things. So if you enjoy those non food related types of videos, um, definitely subscribe. I know I've done. How long do you think she's going to keep the second channel? Because here's the problem. You cannot get monetized right off the bat. It takes, I don't know how many hours. You got to have watch time. And and I think she'll get that. But it's, I think it takes a little bit of time for her to get monetized. So is she going to really take one of her vlogs and put it on that channel and then miss out on the views that she would have got on this channel? I give it maybe one or two weeks and she'll drop that channel. I've heard that she's done that before. Different channels before. Started exactly. them and not finished them. I was kind of confused about what direction I want to do on YouTube. Um, but now I know that I want to do strictly food on here. Just food, guys. <clears throat> All food related stuff. Just food. And then that channel will be non food related stuff. Okay. Because I have a mixed audience because of changing my mind so much with content um, and yeah, trying to incorporate it all. But it, I can see how it would be confusing. Um, to, you know what I'm saying? So I think because it I have a mixed audience, sense. having those two channels will be the best bet. So Alrighty. I have a clear mind about it now. <laughs> so anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching and I'll Bye see you guys. in the next video. Bye guys. Bye. All right, guys. So that was it for this saga in the Chantel series. I think she's going to be back. She said with like some kind of pizza mukbang, which we can expect some kind of epic fart in. And I believe that's it for the week. I don't know, but we shall see again. Thank you all for the beautiful cards. If you all need to contact me, don't forget the uh, email is in the description below. Also, my second channel is in the description below. If you're not subscribed to that, make sure you do. That's, that's it for today, y'all. Let me know what you think in the comments, and I'll see y'all next time. Peace.